we have already discussed about the nutrition in living organism now we will discuss about the human digestive system we take different varieties of food the food we take inside the mouth and it is chewed with the help of our teeth and after chewing it is mixed with saliva now when you hear about this delicious food mouth waters this water from where that we that is the salivary gland secretes saliva which contains an enzyme called amylase this amylase that makes the complex particles of the food into starch and from there it moves through the esophagus through the peristaltic movement and reaches to the stomach even the gastric gland which is present in the stomach secretes hydrochloric acid sometimes when you eat the food you feel stomach pain because of the and we say it is acidity here pepsin also converts the protein digestion helps in that mucus is also present in that stomach from this part the stomach it moves through the uh, inside the small intestine small intestine is the largest part of the alimentary canal the size of the small intestine is different for different organism and here also complete digestion takes place that is uh, trypsin that is the enzyme which is present in the trypsin that converts this uh, uh, proteins and that uh, even bile bile that is a river which secretes bile and that Uh, converts the fats into uh, that uh, of food particles into that is fat particles gets digested with that and pancreatic juice which produces the trypsin and then lipase that is uh, helps in the digestion of the fat okay and from that it this uh, there are small finger like projection which is found in the small intestine which is called villi which increase the surface area of absorption and from there it moves to the uh, large intestine an undigested particle which is passed through the anus through the anus now appendix is a small part which is found in the large intestine and here this it is a vestigial organ and it is not it is uh, for useful only for the cattle for the uh, cellulitis can be digested in the this and in case if it any infection comes over it causes a severe pain which is called the appendicitis